Hey guys, this is Joey from Widget City Blog. You know, we are so sad to finally get a chance to hold this baby. So let's proceed to our Samsung Galaxy S8 review. It is made with back-to-back -back glass like the S7. It is still slippery, still protected by Gorilla Glass, and still attracts fingerprints easily. It is fully dust and water resistant with an IP68 rating. It gives a solid feel with how the glass and metal joins together. The edge is now called the Infinity Screen and Samsung S8 is gorgeous. By far the best looking phone I've ever seen. The first thing you'll notice when you look at the facade is that it's almost all screen. The top and bottom bezels are greatly reduced. Buttons are now on screen but you can physically push on the screen like the old home button. The display is 5.8 inches Quad HD AMOLED. The screen is so tall that the aspect ratio is 18.5 is to 9. And it gives a very sharp and vivid color reproduction. The screen has rounded corners to match the metal frame's curves. The back looks pleasingly symmetrical with a flash and heart rate monitor on one side of the camera and a tiny fingerprint scanner on the other. But expect your camera to be cloudy because the scanner sits so close to the camera, it's quite inconvenient. On the left, you'll find the volume rockers and the dedicated Bixby button, and on the right is the power button. Down below, you'll find the dreaded speaker, and yes, Samsung still included an audio jack unlike Apple. Are you wondering what Bixby is? Bixby is Samsung's artificial intelligence assistant, like Siri. Unlike S7 Edge, you'll encounter almost no accidental touches with S8. S8 has this default gesture from the home screen. You have to swipe up to open the app drawer. It's easy to get used to. S8 also runs an Android Nougat with Exynos 8895 processor, 4 gigs RAM, and of course, it scored better than the S7. And of course, it benched more higher than the S7 Edge. Built-in storage is 64 gigabytes, but it is expandable to 256 gig. Playing games with this machine was a breeze. We had no troubles at all. Samsung Galaxy S8 packed an 8 megapixel front camera with f1.7 aperture. It gives very nice details. And a 12 MP dual pixel with the same impressive f1.7 aperture and other features like optical image stabilization, 4K recording, and slow motion. Here are some photos and videos to look at. S8 is packed with a 3000 mAh battery that will last for a day with average usage. It is fast charging and wireless charging capable as well. In closing, S8 managed to put a huge screen on a petite body without losing any of our favorite features like the expandable storage and water resistance, and even took it to the next level. It is not a perfect phone, but once you experience this phone, you will surely say that it is not like any other phones out there. So grab it now at www.widgetcity.com.ph or just visit us at our store. Thank you for watching, I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to tune in for more tech reviews. This is Joey, see you next time.